My name is Lauren and I'm a product manager here at Calendly. I'm here today to show you our new meeting polls feature. If you're like me, you know scheduling time with a group of people can be really difficult. Whether it's a board meeting, a faculty meeting, a customer meeting, or just a friend's meetup, getting everyone to agree on a time to meet and getting that time on the calendar can be nearly impossible. That's why we created our new meeting polls feature to solve just that problem. Let's jump in and I'll show you how to create your first meeting poll. Once you're signed into Calendly, you'll land on your homepage, which is where you can find our new meeting polls feature. If you click on the create button in the upper right, you'll see meeting polls as an option. You'll also see this create button in meeting polls in our extensions. And if you have the extension installed, you can create a meeting poll directly from your Gmail, which is my personal favorite way of creating polls. But for right now, let's do it on web. When you click meeting polls, we'll pull you into a couple quick steps to set up that meeting poll. First, we want you to select the times you want to offer for this meeting. We'll pull in your connected calendar so you can see what other events you have, and then you can select the times that you want to be able to offer for this event. You can select up to 20 times for this meeting, and these times can even overlap things that are already on your calendar. So let's pick a couple times here and then go on to the next step. On the second step of the meeting poll setup, we'll ask you for the meeting details. The meeting name will be populated in the calendar invite we send to all your invitees when this poll is scheduled, as well as this location. You can choose any of the locations Calendly offers for our event types, including Zoom, Google Meet, and Microsoft Teams. For this one, I'm going to just do a physical address of Calendly headquarters. Lastly, this is a really cool option, guys. We have this option to reserve times. Now, reserve times is going to actually put calendar holds on your calendar to save the time that you're offering in the poll. This means that no one in your organization or anyone else uh, booking with your Calendly link will be able to book those times. And once you've scheduled the meeting um, from this poll, we'll take those reservations off your calendar so it's free again. So definitely be sure to turn this on and check it out. When you publish your meeting poll, you'll get a link, just like any other Calendly event type has, that you can copy and share out via email, Slack, or even text message. Your invitees, when they access that link, will go to a voting page where they can choose what times they're available to attend your meeting. So on the voting page, your invitees will see all those times you've selected to offer, and they can go ahead and select every single one of them that works for them. Once they click next, they'll just fill in their information quickly and they'll be able to keep going. Those times will be shared back with you as the host. And when you come back into your Calendly application and go to your pending events tab, you'll see that meeting poll, all the details, as well as the votes that have been received. When we expand the details here, uh, you can see all the information and you're able to book your meeting time directly from this screen. You can see how many votes you received for each time slot you've offered, and we're even going to highlight the top times for you to make it really easy to book this meeting. When you're ready, just click Book Meeting Time. We will confirm the details with you and the invitee list. The invitee list will include anyone who participated in this poll, not just people available for this time slot. Click Book Meeting, and that meeting is scheduled. All of your invitees, as well as yourself, will have received a calendar invitation to your email for the meeting time you've selected. You can also see and manage that meeting right here in Calendly. We're really excited about this feature and we hope you'll check it out and let us know what you think. Thanks.